I'm a professional video editor with over 250 million views to my name, working with high-level YouTubers. And in this video, I'm going to reveal five AI tools ranked from useful to outright incredible that have personally saved me hundreds and hundreds of hours. The first tool we're going to look at is Premiere Pro's text-based editing. Have you ever expected that your video was going to be really smooth, with everything rolling off the tongue perfectly, making for a really easy edit? You drag the footage into your editing software, and the flow of it is just bad. Premiere Pro's newest beta feature uses AI to automatically detect points of silence in your video, even telling you how long that silence is for. And not only can you then delete this silence and you're left with a nice smooth cut, but this tool also allows you to edit your video through text. Gone are the days of spending ages watching through the full video, finding awkward pauses and making cut after cut after cut, trying to fix them. Let me explain. You load your footage into Premiere Pro, Generate the transcript and the text window, and then you can select words or sentences to cut entirely. For example, whilst I'm filming a video, I might mess up. I'd obviously go back to the start of the sentence and repeat it. That means afterwards in Premiere Pro, I can simply look for any repeated sentences, highlight what I want to delete, which also highlights the timeline down here, and then press backspace and delete it. The next tool that has almost eliminated an entire business model is called Opus Clip AI. Short form content is taking over the fucking world. With the rise of platforms like TikTok, Instagram Reels, and YouTube Shorts, billions upon billions of impressions are flooding into these apps each month. Having edited for a large podcast client before, I used to spend hours and hours watching watching through the entire podcast to find viral clips to post onto these short form platforms. Opus Clip is the answer to that. You simply upload your video or paste the YouTube link and this tool will automatically scrape the whole video and clip up the parts likely to go viral, as well as add engaging captions to them. These clips are then rated from 0 to 99 with Opus Clip's trademarked AI virality score based on AI analysis of thousands of viral videos. There's entire business models based on creating short form content for content creators which come into question with the rise of this tool. But luckily for them, we're not there just yet. Nine times out of 10, this tool works fantastically, but it's still missing a bit of accuracy. Nevertheless, this is still an incredibly capable tool. And as of recording this video, it's only just been launched. So no doubt within the coming months, it will keep getting more and more powerful. Next is a tool that blew my mind when I first tested it out. But quickly before that, before I made any income online, before I got to meet and work alongside my idols, when I was first learning video editing, I was surprised at how little high value content there was out there to help me with my video editing journey. And that's exactly why I created Editors Academy, which takes you from whatever level you're at now, all the way to professional video editor in just 14 days, using a proven formula to find high ticket clients that I've used time and time again, allowing me to work with whoever I want to on demand. There's also an entire lesson within Editors Academy dedicated to using AI to your advantage. So if you've enjoyed this video and you're looking to firstly master video editing and then make serious money from it, feel free to check out the first link in the description for Editors Academy. Now, moving on, it's a platform called Runway. They've developed a ton of AI tools and the first one we'll be looking at is called In Painting. In Painting is where you can select a part of your video, for example, this man walking, and this tool will skip through each and every frame and remove the object. It seems to get this almost spot on and you can often hardly tell the object was even there. I use this for removing things from the shot that shouldn't be there. For example, it could have been used to remove the Starbucks cup from that one episode of Game of Thrones. Another tool on the runway platform is text to video, and this is crazy. You can type in anything you can think of, and in a matter of seconds, it generates a short four second video bringing whatever it is in your mind to life. The possibilities with this are endless. But as a video editor, I tend to use it very occasionally for short segments of B-roll. It's still obvious that it's been created using AI and we're a long way from it looking 100% like a real video. Next, from video generation to image generation. Have you ever had an idea for a section in a video, but it's simply impossible to bring it to life because the idea you're thinking of simply doesn't exist? Unless you're talented in animation, it's going to be hard to solve this problem Problem without this next tool. A few weeks ago, I was editing for a large YouTuber and they were speaking about a very specific scenario in a weed store out in LA. I knew I wanted to represent this with some B-roll on the screen, but there was pretty much no B-roll on stock video sites that would match this specific scenario. Not to mention, these could have got the video demonetized for drugs. I found the solution with image generation. I used ChatGPT's tool called DAL-E 
to generate an image of a jar of broccoli to avoid the demonetization. And then I could layer it up with a background and some other assets to create this B-roll within the video. It would have been borderline impossible to find a jar of broccoli anywhere else. It had to be created from thin air. And that's exactly what tools like Dali and Midjourney are perfect for. Now for number five, we have the most impressive tool on the list in my opinion, Kyber AI. This tool allows you to generate videos entirely using AI. And where this tool differs slightly from what's available within Runway's video generation tool, for example, is purely the level of detail and creativity. To the extent where Linkin Park, a band with over 100 million records sold worldwide, has actually used this tool for their recent music video. You can input videos or images to Kyber and it will allow you to manipulate them using AI in some super creative ways. As well as this, you can add in audio tracks to generate entire videos based off the tone of that music. Scrolling down the gallery on their website here, you can see the extent of how detailed and intricate these creations can be. With billions and billions of dollars flooding into the space, it's clear to see why so many of these tools are advancing week by week, getting better and better. With video editing and the creative space, although it can certainly seem that way, AI will never take over. Sure, you can eliminate time consuming and boring tasks, but you can't substitute creativity and the editing strategy. This is something that has to be mastered by humans. I've actually summarized this entire video, as well as tons more AI tools to supercharge your video editing into a free cheat sheet that you can download simply by clicking the second link in the description. Thank you for watching.